a little bit too far out front of Hill, but he can do some magic, this bloke. Let's see what happens here. Let's see what happens here! <laughs> the full one for the magic there! Okay, here we are with the Masters More Awesome Milestone video. We've got Josh Hill playing his 150th AFL game. We've got some hard-hitting questions for you, Josh, so belt up. Well done, mate. Congratulations, mate. Thanks, mate. So, one of the big occasions in your career was winning the uh, Ross Glendening medal. Yep. Can you run us through that and um, how it made you feel and um, one of the highlights of the game? Uh, yeah, pretty proud moment for myself. You know, growing up in WA, watching a lot of derbies as a kid and uh, being a part of it every year is it's been uh, great for me and to be able to win the award is just a great achievement and I've seen players like, you know, Pritta uh, win it, uh, Juddy and Cousins and all of them in the past, so yeah, it's great to be amongst all those players. Put yourself in the same echelon as those kind of guys? No, I'll put up there with Pritta, you know, because we're cousins. <laughs> <laughs> and Hill drives it home! I'm just going to check, I can see something under your shirt there. That's, that's not the Ross Glendon, you you're still wearing it, eh? <laughs> he's still, he's still got it on. <laughs> it's home framed up on the wall, yep. <laughs> How many days? Like, did you wear it for until you framed it? Was it all the way up until you framed it, or was it? Yeah, I couldn't take it off. I even slept it with it sometimes, yeah. 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 Heard you were out uh, partying with it as well at that nightclubs. Is, that is a false lie right there. That was your idea. A false lie, so a truth. That is a lie. <laughs> Sorry, I mixed that up. It's a double negative. That is a lie. <laughs> that is a false <laughs> accusation, I meant to say. You're false right accusation. Check, it? Yeah, it is. <laughs> you kick a lot of goals, but do you reckon Josh celebrates with the crowd a little bit too much? There's a, there's a little bit of that. I think you, you, you don't... There's a truth behind that. What's the truth? I'm always working hard, you know, sliding towards the goal. Oh, and resty! Then, <laughs> then I get the goal and there's no one to celebrate with, so I might as well get it amongst the crowd. Is that because so, they're always over the back? Yeah, Is there a exactly. Stat the so, most goals from the goal square at our club? Yeah, I think there might be. I, could be I think you're number one. Yeah, well, if it's not me, it's Lekker. Still a chance off the ground, Hill! Somehow they have kicked the goal! Obviously, like, most guys go through their careers with different hairstyles and all that stuff, yeah. so... The moment you kind of shaved the head and grew the little bit of beard, yep. you, know, beard. you know, you've kind of stuck with that all the way. <laughs> yep. So I'm just wondering, was it because one day you got told you look like Denzel Washington? <laughs> or was it simply that you were bored and you can't be bothered changing it? Or C, yep. you're actually going <clears throat> bored like Bunga? I'm definitely not looking like Bunga, but uh, I cop a few Barack Obama lookalikes here and there. Um, Apparently I look like Craig David when I wear a beanie. Um, there's a lot of resemblance out there, but I don't know, I think I was just bored one day and I just thought, you know what, I'll stick with it. And I'm definitely not balding, so I'm not gonna grow a beard like you because, you know, if you shave, your head will look very small. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I've just stuck with it ever since I've started. So never had any complaints, never had any, any issues. You've kicked a lot of fluky goals in your career, you know, yep. out of midair, mm -hmm. other than the ones from the goal square. <laughs> um, which is your favorite fluky goal? Uh, it would probably have to be last year against Hawthorne, yeah, that final. Yeah, I think it was JK trying to be hungry, get another goal on the side 50, and yeah, I was lucky enough to get to the crumb, and I knew I couldn't get hands to it, so I stuck a boot out and came off mid-air, and I did give it to the crowd then, because I was feeling a bit, a bit pumped up, but yeah, the boys got amongst me, it was good. Hill out of mid-air, there is the icing on the Friday night cake. Oh, well, that'll do us, I reckon. Thank you very much for joining us, Josh Hill. Make sure we get that right <laughs> yeah, so he doesn't take the, uh, <laughs> take the ball away. Thanks, Congratulations Jared. on 150 games. Well done, mate.